but now, but now the good thing is there's a there's a chilling effect for this. So now everybody out there will not doubt the power of the WAP. Uh, they will not doubt Cardi B, and they will think twice before they question her. Um, yeah, I, I is... think this is what Kurt. You love the I, power. I, of the I, I only hope you're being sarcastic because I don't think there's any chilling effect to this whatsoever. Because this is just a this is a woman who's no. a pile of stupid, and maybe just don't go out and blatantly make up lies. If that's a chilling effect, man, I don't know. <laughs> I, yeah, I, I would, I would, I would agree. Well, it's it's not necessarily but, a chilling effect, but I do agree. I do agree with Andrew that it it. It sh and it should it should lead people, including YouTubers and and bloggers and other people that are that are you know just talking about celebrities. It should lead them to do some due diligence about the claims that they're making because exactly. all all she needed, all Tasha K needed in this case was to say, I had you know I I did some research. I had you know this information, this information, this information that I that I relied upon because I did mm -hmm. a little bit of research on this, <laughs> you know. Um, that's, that's, that's all you need in order to show that you're not being reckless about mm -hmm. a, a, a famous person. Yeah. And, and look, no, I, I was being, I was being 50% serious, 50% not serious as I normally am, but I think you're exactly right. It's about specific claims and keeping people from making specific claims, um, in yeah. general, you know, and I think that's a smart thing for everybody to remember that even somebody who's as sullied as, Cardi B, because it's one of the arguments. I think even Ron Coleman made that point at one point that, you know, she's so sullied, you know, she's, what hasn't Cardi B talked about? She talked about drug pe drugging people and robbing them, you know, but she said, oh, well, they were willing simps, you know, they liked it, they enjoyed it, that was a kink, whatever, I, whatever, you know, was going on with that. But she said those things, so you'd think that would make her, as a public figure, kind of not able to collect on anybody. You'd think it would be very difficult, but even somebody who's gone to Cardi B's level can still recover. This tells you the scope of defamation.